So what's good YouTube? What's up with you man? It's your boy at Jobshot23 back at again another video and first thing first make sure you guys comment like and subscribe if you're new to the channel and more videos are coming away. Now guys listen as NBA 2K22 is coming to an end you know what I'm saying we still got one more season to go but pretty much guys I pretty much got a glitch build that y'all can make you know what I'm saying for anybody that's still playing the game. Now this build right here is pretty special I'm not gonna lie you know what I'm saying it's, but this is pretty much the JT JC Tatum build you know what I'm saying so um um, so anybody who wants to make this build, you know what I'm saying? I want y'all to just watch the video, you know what I'm saying? So that you guys could get the full understanding of how y'all could make this build, you know what I'm saying? Because this build to me is pretty cheesy, you know what I'm saying? Uh, a, lot, a lot of people don't really know it. But anyways, check this out. First and first, you guys obviously know what to do. Make sure you guys go to settings and make sure you guys pull your, your shift from Imperial to Metric. Now, this is only a one-step process for this glitch, you know what I'm saying? Um, this glitch is not really gonna, gonna take too long, you know, you know what I'm saying? So pretty much, after you guys switch from Imperial to Metric, now you guys just go into my career, you know what I'm saying? You guys click on any, create a new build, and then, you know what I'm saying? And then, this is where the glitch kicks in. Y'all just wanna make sure you make this build as a point guard, you know what I'm saying? The jersey number doesn't really matter, your hand doesn't matter, you know what I'm saying? And then, after you guys get here, all I want you guys to do is just, um, you know, for the height, just bring it down to 1.77 meter, as you guys could see on the screen. And then after, for the weight, you just want to make sure the weight is at 175 kg, you know what I'm saying? And then after you guys are done doing that, and then after, um, for the wingspan, you guys just want to make sure you put it at 1.83. I mean, not 1.83, my fault. Um, make sure you guys put a weight at uh, 6 kg and then put your wingspan to 1.75. And then after, make sure you guys go either put a compact or anything that you want. Now listen, now everything that you guys are seeing on the screen, just copy. You know what I'm saying? Everything that you guys go, you see on the screen. But pretty much, um, you know what I'm saying? But pretty much, the only reason I'm just bringing this video out to y'all is because you know what I'm saying. Um, like I said, this build is pretty cheesy. You know what I'm saying? This build, um, this build is very great for park. You know what I'm saying? Um, this is definitely a good build uh, for the park you know what i'm saying for all my park players you know what i'm saying that's so be paying park you know what i'm saying so today like i said this build's pretty much great this is pretty much you know what i'm saying like exactly like jt you know what i'm saying this build could shoot it has a high three point you're six eight um you know what i'm saying you still have a high ball control so you, you could sort of like cheese and dribble with this build you know what i'm saying depending if you all know how to dribble you know what i'm saying but you could be much do like one two moves to get yourself open um the defense um, um, the defense too is pretty amazing, you know what I'm saying? But as you guys could see, the only downfall is that you know um, your wingspan is very very small, you know what I'm saying? So obviously when it comes to like you guys trying to get steals in the passing lanes, it's not really gonna be the best for you guys. I'm not saying you guys can get steals in passing lanes. You guys can. The only issue is that you know what I'm saying you know like there's gonna be a lot of times where you're pretty much in the passing lane and you're still you're still not gonna get the steal just only because you have a, um, a shorter wind spank so you know so always keep that in mind you know but other than that this is pretty much a great great build for the park you know what i'm saying park anti up you could low-key use this build for the wreck you know what i'm saying i wouldn't even recommend anyone using this build for prom because it's not really a pro and build you know what i'm saying just because like i said um the wind spank you know what i'm saying plays a huge factor in prom and prom is obviously there's there's obviously better builds that you can make so i'm making a 6 eight, you know what i'm saying so as you guys go see, you know what I'm saying, uh, I'm still um i'm still trying to upgrade um you know what i'm saying um like the attributes and stuff the only reason i'm going slow is because you know what i'm saying there's certain um number that you know what i'm saying you guys must um must upgrade and stuff you know what i'm saying so like that's why i'm taking a little bit longer making this but guys listen this is much a glitch right here this is only a one-step process you know what i'm saying um this you know what i'm saying uh, and this glitch you know what i'm saying once you guys um pass this part then that's what the glitch is gonna kick in i promise you know what i'm saying but pretty much you know uh, um so pretty much i'm still just upgrading you know what i'm saying what do i need to upgrade you know what i'm saying but guys keep in mind everything that you guys are seeing on the screen just copy everything that you guys are seeing you know what i'm saying and then um and then after um for, you guys you guys should already know by now that the primary and secondary takeover doesn't matter and then after after you guys are done you guys should get a coin machine if y'all don't if y'all don't get uh, you know what i'm saying uh, the name of the bill as, as a scoring machine y'all mess up you know what i'm saying but after you guys are done obviously you guys know what to do switch it back from uh, metric back to imperial 
and then uh, and then after you guys switch it back from there oh uh, and then like this is pretty much you know i've seen the glitch the glitch is right here so as you guys could see you guys show still be a point guard the only difference is that you're now 510 so you guys should get 510 147 pounds you know what i'm saying and then your waistband should be 59 if you guys see this that means you guys definitely did a glitch right you know what i'm saying because you know what I'm saying? because this is where the glitch kicks in as you guys will see you know what I'm saying? and then after you much just put your height from 510 to 68 which you know which you guys could see on the screen and then the pounds you guys could put 183 and then wingspan is 67 you know what i'm saying so as you guys could see um you know this is pretty much proven evidence that this build is 68 you know what i'm saying but guys however guys you could pretty much make this build the way how you want to make it you know what i'm saying so like if you feel like a 67 wind spring is too low and it's pretty much you know what i'm saying uh, the wind spring that you guys don't like then you guys could obviously bring the wind spring but the whole point of making this build it's just because you know what i'm saying um you know i'm this um the whole point of making this build is just because of obviously it's not just you know what i'm saying um like i'm trying to you know what i'm saying um pretty much um make it as a jt jason Tatum, but it's also because um you know what i'm saying you you actually get high shooting with this build you know what i'm saying like your three partner is almost like close to a 90 you know but you guys will see on the screen and as you guys could see you know what i'm saying you have an 83 ball control with this build a 6 a usually, usually does not get 83 ball control i think your eyes ball control is about like an 80 80 or 81 so the fact that you're getting 83 ball control is actually good you know what i'm saying but guys check this out bro like check out those shooting badges like the shooting badges you know what i'm saying uh, for this build is crazy you know what i'm saying so like um at this point like for me like i'm just trying to um i'm just trying to you know what i'm saying pretty much like um put the attribute that um that like i pretty much run on this build you know what i'm saying uh and then pretty much like i'm just showing y'all you know what i'm saying uh if i was to make this build like pretty much like whoa like what would i upgrade and stuff you know what i'm saying and then pretty much for me as you guys can see on defense you still get um silver interceptor which that's pretty good you know what i'm saying and then pretty much um i'm just pretty much just playing around you know what i'm saying like the attribute and stuff and like and like and like pretty much like stuff that i will upgrade this and that you know what i'm saying and then guys as you guys could see uh i pretty much gave myself 84 driving down just because um just because you still get the pro contact you know it's at 84 and then after um the past accuracy uh i decided to give myself 85 i think 85 or 86 but 85 or 86 doesn't really matter because you're still gonna get the gold bullet pass um i think i um i think i end up making 87 but you guys will see later on in the video just because i wanted um the gold needle threader needle threader is a very underrated badge you know what i'm saying a lot of people really be sleeping on that badge but that badge actually works you know what i'm saying and then um and then as you guys could see i'm just trying to give myself more defense you know what i'm saying and then pretty much um for finishing like my finishing is pretty good i just end up getting myself a 70 driving layup you know what i'm saying and as you guys could see but th that three point is so high but like your three point ends up going to 89 80 or 89 but i pretty much give myself 88 you know what i'm saying because 80 89 doesn't really make a difference and then and, and then after as you guys could see uh i just you know what i'm saying i'm just pretty much just trying to play around you know what i'm saying like the attributes and stuff you know just want to get extra badges and uh but pretty much um you know what i'm saying but pretty much like my whole goal was i was actually trying to give myself an 80 vertical you know what i'm saying and as you guys could see my vertical is only a 79 so i'm like no what well, there you know what i'm saying so i'm like no what well, um like there has to be a way for me to get an 80 vertical you know what i'm saying so pretty much you know so i kind of had to take down certain attributes before me to give me you know give myself 80 and as you guys could see like my vertical store is 79 so i'm like no what well, maybe let me just take something down you know what i'm saying but guys you know what i'm saying this build is cheesy like trust me but this is definitely a cheesy build you know what i'm saying um this build kind of reminds me of um like pretty much a um pretty much a um a six seven so like one inch shorter but like you know what i'm saying but like you pretty much have like high um um high shooting you know what i'm saying um yeah pretty good on um, ball handling so pretty much go play keep badges go shooting badges you know what i'm saying this is pretty much like a 12 version of um a play shot you know what i'm saying it could be much dribble shoot this and that you know but pretty much uh, after you guys sit down creating this build you know what i'm saying for the take i i just decided you know what 
let me just give myself double limitless you know what i'm saying because double limitless is cheesy of course and then as you guys could see you all should get the name as two-way sharpshooter you know what i'm saying but you guys just comment down below how y'all think about this build i didn't that issue but i dropped shot 23 and i'm out